Please have a seat here, facing the, the camera. Now, thank you. Yes. La I have to tell you this. Yeah. Last time we were here. Yeah. Saying hello to you. Right. You took a, ca a picture of us. I did. Yes. Did I? With a plastic camera. A plastic camera. That's right. Called a Holga. A Holga. Yeah. We love the picture you took of us. Well, it's funny that you should say that because I was taking pictures yesterday and I dropped a camera and it and it's dead. It's not the same camera, obviously, but that's. Uh, I think I've gone through about ten since uh, this incident and I can't remember a plastic. A camera. I, mean, I usually go well, for we the... brought it. We oh, it you brought you. the camera. Oh, all right. That's a different story. Did you get the thing back? Yeah, we have. It's an unbelievable. It might be your best photograph. Oh, well, this this is interesting. <laughs> I can't wait. You, want <laughs> you by any chance have the photograph? Or, you, <laughs> or did it burn in a fire? Yeah, great. You look good. I doubt it. I ain't got no bad and nobody cares for me. The first time I remember hearing him play was at the Mariposa Folk Festival. It was to me the best folk festival going because it was, they put everybody out on an island and so there was no security. You, they drop you off on the island and just leave you there. You know, and you could take a ferry back to the mainland. And there was all this great, great music going on and everybody was really mellow about the whole thing. In the book, uh, the festival book, like to say, so you know who everybody is, to be a little short bio. And Leon said that Leon Redbone is a blues singer and he resides in Toronto because of the incident in Philadelphia. <laughs> that was his bio. And uh, uh, I thought, I gotta go see this guy just, just for that bio. He was, uh, seemed like the reincarnation of uh... Jimmy Rogers or Blind Boy Fuller. He played a lot of blues and a lot of uh, uh, Jimmy Rogers style country blues, which really turned me on. I thought he was amazing. So we're doing a workshop together and uh, Leon finishes and scurries off to his next, either his next workshop or just to hide. I don't know what. Bob Dylan arrived at the Mariposa Folk Festival in a in a private launch, got out, came up to me and said, what stage is Leon Redbone at? And I said, stage six. Bob goes, where is he? And I said, who? And he said, you know. I said, Leon? And he says, he says, yeah. And I said, he went that way. So you see Bob Dylan, his wife behind him, and the children all trailing, right? And they're following Leon around this island. And then everybody else c copped on to the fact that Bob Dylan was there with his family. So they started following Bob Dylan and his family. <laughs> it was a trail to this island of people. Later that day, Gordon Lightfoot came out. I guess we heard Dylan was there. And they got together. And the end of the afternoon, a Chris Craft is leaving the island. Everybody else takes a ferry. And it's Bob Dylan. Gordon Lightfoot and Leon with his shades on and his cap, his hat, sitting in the back of the Chris Crab smoking a cigar. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna These ask you the question we asked. They're not everyone. too difficult, I hope. Can you introduce yourself? Let me introduce you. What? Can it, what? 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 What is your name and what do you do? I don't know. <laughs> what, is, what is my name? What to do? Okay. Well, that should be simple enough, shouldn't it? Yeah. So you know my name, so that's not, part, that's not much of a response. Uh, and what do I do? I, do, I try and do as, as little as possible. Uh, and as far as uh, in performance is what you meant. I see. Okay. Uh, uh, I try and find the next song, which, which is... Uh, haphazard thinking.
because I don't know what the first song was to begin with. So I try and do the next one. It doesn't work most of the time, but I'm still trying. Ah. Interesting. Maybe I got it on backwards. Yep, I haven't been well lately. <laughs> I went to the doctor and they had told me what to do, but I didn't do it. Didn't do it? I didn't do it. <laughs> well, what did that man tell you to do? Who? The doctor. Oh. He told me to take one pill three times a day, but you know you can't do that. Come on, baby, give me some more of it, did it, what did it? Somebody tell me what did it, what did it mean? Come on, get on, come on, sit, wait a minute, oh, baby. Well, Leon, his continued popularity, I think, is as a result, first of all, of playing great songs. He's a really, he has an incredible sense for picking great songs to play. Not to minimalize everything, but in a simple sort of way, it's because he's an attractive package. You know, I mean, he dressed perfectly well. He, to the degree that he spoke to you at all, it was, I mean, he was just perfect. And he could really play. Let's not underestimate how he was a great musician, terrific guitar player. Could really say. Close your eyes and think of this time traveler of what your interpretation of such a person would be. He's come from the past to entertain us. And when we're not looking, he steps back again. So there's no way he has an opportunity to describe who he is or where he's from or what he's doing. But at the night of the concert, he was shown. I don't do mystery. The only thing I do, which may have created some, uh, you know, uh, the cliche mystery person, is the fact that I'm non-compliant. And, I, and I've always been non-compliant. I'm not interested in anything that anybody else is interested in uh, that I should be interested in. It just doesn't work for me. I, I like what I like, and that's, that's the way it is. Which is, which sounds a little harsh, but, uh, but it, it, what else would you do? I'm about here, so I should be sitting down. Sit it's also interested in lenses many years ago. I had a lens for an update. I could buy any kind of lens I could get my hands on. So what am I doing here? Just, just looking at not talking. Right? Yeah. yeah. That's right. You got it. Please don't talk about me when I'm gone. Oh, honey, though our friendship 
She says from now on If you can say anything reminds It's better not to talk at all That's my advice You go your way, I'll go my best. We used to play billiards. Uh, he was, is a very good, I assume still, a very, very good billiards player. And we'd go to Q Billiards, which was at Young and Bloor, uh, where the subway walk down is. And they knew him as Sonny. Uh, or Mr. Charles, I think. When you spend six nights uh, in a row with people, you get some insight because uh, it was always my job as almost a hostess in a way to make sure that they had everything they wanted and to make them feel comfortable and, and to understand them. And there was there was no understanding Leon Redbone other than he wanted to do his job and there was no there was nothing more than that, nothing more or less than that. Like I can tell you that um, he doesn't care for Mexican food but I don't know who his parents are, you know, and I'm sure I never will. He was impenetrable, that mystique. You just couldn't get a straight answer from him. The mystique has helped bring people to him, and then they get the music. When you see him on a darkened stage, on a little coffee table and a lamp, a, ta a table lamp, and a glass with whiskey in it. Not water or, or apple juice, a whiskey glass. And his guitar. And he'd start whistling. And, and then you hear his music. I don't... OK, who is he? He's Leon Redbone. That's who he is. This is what he does. Please. Don't talk about me when I'm gone. Oh, honey, though our friendship ceases from now on. If you can't say anything real nice, it's better not to talk at all. That's my advice You go your way I'll go mine Best we do Here's a kiss I hope that this Brings lots of luck to you Makes no difference How I carry on Oh, honey, please don't talk about me when I'm Sing along numbers, you know. <laughs> you didn't preface it by saying, Why am I looking into the lens? No, it's good. I was waiting for something to happen. This is, yeah, nothing. This is nothing. A, something exciting. Absolutely anything. nothing. Well, I, <laughs> the, the only exciting thing would have been, That's it. <laughs> God. That's it? But, that, was the, that was the simple part. What's the other, what's the sophisticated part of it? <laughs> That's great. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, yeah. watch the, the uh, <clears throat> 
Yeah. You're uh, trying to bring back the avant-garde uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> French New Wave. <laughs> That's good. I'm glad to hear that. Because anything outside of that would have been problem. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, have to do, I guess. Have to do.